Well, I don't really have anything to make a video on. Um, I guess what I tinkered around with a little bit today was getting this wiring harness situation on the Bronco uh, kind of cleaned up a little bit. I didn't really get far because I'm going to have to modify things a little bit in order to get the little fuse box mounted up. And I've got a bunch of wires that go nowhere. Absolutely nowhere. Okay, actually, I need the keys. Um, yeah, got a can of spray paint there. I was just covering those gay, gay flames, whoever painted on this stupid thing. Kind of like what's right here. That is so gay. Anyway, I gotta get this thing running first. Once I get it running to where it'll idle on its own, then I'll be able to worry about some of the cosmetics. I'm gonna sandblast it and paint it all one color. Um, the Bronco 2, I had a few people, a few subscribers ask me if I still had it. I do still have it. I just got that driver front tire put back on this afternoon because this the bead was leaking on the back of the rim so cleaned it up and reset the bead and the B2 is is uh, still here for now um, it depending on how what I can get done with that other Bronco this one's probably gonna go to my brother um, and that ram is a five on five and the rams on this Bronco are four on are five on four and a half so obviously that rim didn't work so I'm glad I never had any troubles out on the field I mean out on the trail we got the wood splitter from hell I got a lot of wood splitting to do um, my dad and I have a lot split already but we need more um, trailer the old 72 still sitting here it's not really going anywhere. I might do a start up and drive video of it someday. But we'll see how it goes. Uh, Cavalier over here. Did a clutch on it earlier this summer. It doesn't really go anywhere. It's more like a paid off spare car. We had a hailstorm come through and did some damage to the to the car I mean it's really hard to tell there are some little hail damage spots and the insurance guy totaled it and uh, my dad chose to buy it back for retarded uber cheap and so now we have a paid off car Saturn which you can't see because the Sun my three-quarter ton runs nothing wrong with it nothing wrong with the Saturn but it Saturn, I uh, did that TP sensor and it fixed the tranny. So now the tranny runs great. So, hell, I've got a free car that's getting me about 30 miles to the gallon. Why would I drive anything else? This is a little Kohler 14 horsepower engine. I did a video on it earlier this summer. Well, I guess earlier in the summer. It's kind of winter now, but we've got it. I took it all apart, cleaned it up put it back together and my dad's been fighting it for a while um, honestly I don't have time to help him with it but he's got the carb on I don't know what else he's having troubles with on it but I'll have to ask him maybe I can take it over I don't know I think he's needing some more parts for it but I mean it's a 1977 case so parts are kind of hard to find and are expensive so if anyone knows where I can get a shop manual for that thing for pretty cheap, let me know. Other than that, that's my uh, vlog or whatever the hell you want to call it, video update. Adios.